Use code SPIKEFEEDERS for 5% off at facetofacegames.com. You can shop face-to-face games in US dollars, Canadian dollars, or even euros, and they'll ship just about everywhere. That's code SPIKEFEEDERS at checkout at facetofacegames.com to help support the show. What's up, Spikes? We are back playing Rule Zero Decks. If you don't know what that means, uh, go watch the other game. We'll have it up in the thing. Or the yeah. spike on the mic we recorded? Or the spike on the mic we recorded. We'll put that up in the thing, yeah. too, um, where we explain all about Rule Zero and how you can build decks that don't conform to the actual literal rules of Commander. Um, yeah, today we're playing the same decks as we played last time. I am playing the Ozolith. This is a Voltron deck with the Ozolith in the command zone. I'm going to animate it with Tezzeret's Touch or Soul Artifact or whatever and put a whole bunch of counters on it and kill people until they die. Yeah. I'm playing Girth one Eye. It's a 264. I think it's 264. Uh, the deck list will be correct. Uh, card list um, where I'm trying to battle the wits. So uh, I'm just hoping it survives around the table. Or I find it. You find it before you draw 65 cards. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Because right. I need 200 cards in the deck. There you go. Mm-hmm. Awesome. Hi, everybody. I'm Alex. And today I'm playing Assemble the Legion. We're going to be making so many tokens out of things. I got no actual creatures in this deck, so we're looking for anthems. We're looking for planeswalkers. We're looking for big board states that go sideways fast. Uh, And I'm Jan, and I'm playing Riku of the Two Reflections, Flash Hulk, Zero Drop Tribal. Uh, I'm just going to play Zero Drops and do weird stuff with them. Um, Like weird gameplay stuff, right? No. No. Oh. No. Oh. Who like, won the like, die roll? Like that kind <laughs> yeah. of stuff. <laughs> uh, that. Yeah, I won the die roll. So I'm going to first. Go. I'm going to start the game by drawing a card. I'm going to play a swamp and cast a soul ring. <gasps> and then uh, I'm going to pass it through. Untap upkeep draw. I'm going to play a forest and I'm going to play an ignoble hierarch and pass the turn. <gasps> wow. How ignoble of you. This is a plane's pass. I'm going to draw. It's not a soul ring. I'm going to play this island, and I'm going to suspend this Ancestral Visions. Nice. I'm going to pass. Okay. I'll untap. Draw a card. I'm going to play this Swamp. Then I'm going to tap three and cast Crystalline Giant. Huh. Uh, this is a 3-3 three, three go- uh, Sorry, 3-3 three, three Giant. I thought it was a Golem, but of course, Crystalline Giant. I suppose it would make mm. sense that it's a Giant. Uh, at the beginning of combat on my turn, I can choose a kind of counter uh, at random that Crystalline Giant doesn't have on it from among Flying First Strike, Death Touch, Hexproof, Lifelink, Menace, Reach, Trample, Vigilance, and plus one plus one, and put that kind of counter on it. Then I'm going to cast my commander. The Ozolith. The Ozolith. That's and the then name I'm the going to pass the turn. Uh, you technically Oh, I got to move to combat. And we do the thing. Okay, we selected a counter at random. It doesn't have flying, and now it does. <gasps> then I'm going to pass the turn to Jer. Untap, upkeep, draw. I'm going to play out a flooded strand. And on top of this flooded strand, I'm going to put my finger. I'm going to move my finger. Uh, I'm then going to <laughs> play a mana crypt. Uh, and I'm going to tap two, including a green off the ignoble hierarch. And I'm going to, uh, so tap four mana and I'm going to cast an abundance. Oh, and I love that card. Yeah, me too. I love that card. Great Land card. and non-land. Yeah. Land and non-land. You get to choose what you draw. Um, and then just because to save time, ah, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> just to save time. time pass. pass the turn. No more game. Action. Mountains. <laughs> Boros signet. Pass. Okay. Abundance is not. Us, right? It's just Jerry. Just Jerry. Yeah. Right, good. I'm going to take down my Ancestral Visions. Draws card. Ho, 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 ho. Forest. And uh, go. I'll untap. Draw a card. I'm going to play an island. And cast this. Oh, not that way. Cast this Chasm Skulker. Ooh, that's a good one. I thought that was a hull breacher for a second. I'm like, sir, cast okay. this hull breacher. Rule zero, Jerry. Yeah, rule zero, <laughs> Don't Jerry. Don't even at me. Uh, then I'm going to move to combat. And we will randomly select a thing for a Crystalline Giant. Okay, so we uh, picked a counter for a Crystalline Giant to get. It's lifelink. <gasps> uh, then I'm going to pass the turn. End of your turn. I'm going to crack Flooded Strand. I'll get this Raugrin. 
I think that's how you pronounce it. Try them. And I will untap the turn. Jan, can you hand me the lovely coin over there? All right. Uh, what's up Spikes' damage? <laughs> I yeah. take damage. I, I didn't flick I'll, at that I'll time. I'll allow it. <laughs> I tried cheating and it didn't work. Man, Chaos Orb rules really getting after it, you there. It almost worked and then it didn't. <laughs> okay, I'm going to draw a card for turn. I'm going to play an island. Um, and I'm going to do what this deck does, which is tap five mana. Uh, including two blue, and I'm going to play a Battle of Wits. <laughs> oh, God. Uh-oh. Uh, I forgot to... It's a good thing Abundance is a May, because I forgot to name a card type and do the Abundance trigger, but it is a May, so I'm okay. just uh, misplaying. Yeah. Go ahead. All right. Well, I'll get ready for my last turn here. How many cards do you think he has in his library? I don't know. Uh, definitely 199. Yeah, I'm not even going to count. It's too, it's too little. Yeah, it's too mm. little. In any case, this is Outlaw's Merriment. At the beginning of my upkeep, choose one at random. Create a red and white creature token with these characteristics. Pass turn. I don't mm. pass turn was characteristic. All right. Tick down. Interesting. Naturalize. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's not good. I don't think Naturalize and John Cena go together like that, but I'm not going to fight it. It's because you can't see him with your natural eyes. Oh. <laughs> du, 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 du. <laughs> well, no, I'm just, it's like you, you're running out of time. You got the, the music is playing, Jan. The music yeah. is playing. I'm going to this island. Um, and I don't know, in case something happens, uh, I'm going to play this Astral Cornucopia for one. I love Astral Cornucopia. Uh, and then I'm going to pass. Okay. Well, I'm going to cast Deadly Dispute, sacrificing my Crystalline Giant. Oh. Uh, put the counters on this thing and draw two cards. Make two treasures. Make one treasure, sorry. Uh, and put two counters on the Chasm Skulker. Nice. Then, I guess I'll untap. Draw a card. Hmm. Is there any way we can stop this? You could do anything to Battle of Wits or prevent me from getting an upkeep. So kill Jerry. Oh, yes. <laughs> I re- <laughs> Play a swamp. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll play a. What is this? Six. I'll play walking ballista X equals three. And uh, pass the turn. Um, I don't want to count. This is more than 200. You got it. Yeah. Well, sometimes you just get extremely lucky in a Battle of Wits deck. Here's the thing, Jerry. I, I just want to say that I'm very proud that of all the things you managed to beat somebody with, it was your wits. Huh. I was excited because maybe there was a creature that could have done a thing, but then I was like, oh, it's off the library. That's not uh, a card to draw right mm-hmm. now. No, I don't think great, it is. Good. Yeah. yeah, good. I, what is that, turn four? I, I think. Nope. Jerry's turn three. Jerry's well, turn four. Jerry's no. turn four. This is Jerry's, Jerry's turn, turn four. four. Yeah. yeah. Wow. That's great. Wow, I, I think we shuffle up again. Yeah, because that was that too. twenty-five minutes. Patrons, not even. Joy, <laughs> yeah, not even. Yeah. Uh, well, folks, uh, we are uh, really happy with this game. Um, we're going to play another one real quick. In fact, it has been a long, long time, but I think we could even call it a double up. <gasps> That's the name of the movie. <laughs> so, patrons, if you're watching this, there should be another game right after it, like maybe a day later. Uh, but for everyone else, there will be another g- piece of gameplay on the Monday after this one comes out. Yep. You know this was a short one, so that's why we're going to shuffle up, play one more real quick one, because we care about you. And if you care about us, you can go to face2facegames.com for all your card needs. You can slam the code SPIKEFEEDERS in at the end of the thing. Get yourself 5% off on all the cards you need. Help support the show, help support the cards in your collection, and we'll see you next time. Huge shout out to all of our patrons, especially those listed here. If you haven't checked the Patreon in a while, check it out again. We've got some new bonuses for folks who pledge at $20 or above. So if you haven't checked us out, please do so. And once again, thank you for all your support over the years. We really appreciate it. Hey, thank you for checking out the Spike Feeders on YouTube. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button before you close the window, or you can click on this link to check out our other great videos.